Well, hello, ladies, gentlemen, people of the world. I'm back with another review today. Um, not a drink, not a food, but a snack review. That's right. So, today, I've been, first of all, I've been seeing this come up on my social medias everywhere. Um, sour strips, sour strips, sour strips. So, I decided to go online and find out what the hype was all about. Because I don't have a store close enough to me that sells these sour strips. So I had to buy some online. And I bought myself a six pack. Um, you can create a build your own bag with three different flavors. It gives you two bags each of each flavor. So, I decided, what the heck. Um, I decided to get myself the Sour Strips Cotton Candy. Okay. I love, I love the character on them. Sour Strips Green Apple. Mm-hmm. And I'm excited about this one. Sour Strips Apple Berry. Yeah. You got your strawberry. Motion into the green apple there. So, I'm excited. Uh, the first one I think I would want to try um, would be the apple berry. So I'm just going to, you know, go ahead and crack into it. So the deal with sour strips is it's supposed to be like an actual sour candy. Um, I've had some pretty sour candies in my life. Um, I love sour stuff. And I... I love the rainbow strips, um, like the actual rainbow, you know, extreme airheads. Those are delicious. So let's see if these will become my new favorite, you know, sour snacks. Um, the price I paid for them, it's $25. But, I mean, it also took like seven days to get here. So, you know, shipping isn't really that, you know, back then nowadays. Uh, let's get one of these out here. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, they smell delicious. Alright. Sour strips. Apple berry. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Wow. All right. Wow. I put that here. First thoughts. Sour. Yes. They got that going for them. Those are amazing, though. They really do taste delicious. Um, they're not, they're not bad at all. Um, so. Definitely can taste the flavors in them. Like, they, they pop. The flavors just pop. Um, moving on to cotton candy. I know a lot of uh, places try to imitate the cotton candy flavor. Um, this being in the sour candy, we'll see how it is. I don't know. Can't really be that sour if it's cotton candy, you know. So let's uh, let's break into these and uh, give one a try, shall I? Ooh, pretty color. Look at that color. Ooh, those ones have a weird smell to them. Oh, mm. wow.
All right, so let's talk about it. Cock candy, sour? Yes. Um. As for the cotton candy taste, it's very drowned out by the sourness. It tastes sweet. Kind of like that artificial cotton candy, you know, that you get in most things that try to say that they're cotton candy flavored. They're not bad, but probably my last choice, honestly. They just smell funky when you open up the pack. The sourness and cotton candy don't really mix with each other. These would be good if they didn't have that sour stuff on them. But because of that sour stuff, it drowns out the actual cotton candy taste. And it's just... It's a weird taste in your mouth. I'm sorry, I have to get some water. That... That really, uh... Messed up my taste buds. Ugh. Ah. Alright, so. Now, we move on to the final one. Green apple. These things are very sour. They, they're a hell of a lot more sour than airheads or anything like that. Not as sour as warheads, but they're up there. They're up there with warheads. Green apple. Ooh, ooh. Definitely, uh, get that appleness. Okay. Wow. Between the green apple and the appleberry, my two favorite. Um, I could only, I guess they have a whole bunch of flavors of these. They have, uh, obviously the three I got, blue raz, tropical mango, um, there's a few more on their website that I couldn't really get. I think they had one that was like Raz Apple or something like that. Like Raspberry Apple. I'm not sure. I believe that's what it was. But, you know, the Belger own six bag. Like I said, you can choose three flavors. They'll give you two bags of each flavor that you choose. Um, not bad pricing. Um, they're good candy, but if you can find them in the stores, I highly suggest just getting them in stores because buying them online was, you know, a hassle. Definitely had to wait forever for them to even show up, and I'm very disappointed in the cotton candy one. Um, like I said, the sour, it just takes away from the sweetness, and I don't think it's supposed to be like that. The sour really works with the appleberry and the green apple because green apples are supposed to be sour. And you automatically get that once you bite into it. Um, this, it's sweet and sour, so it's delicious. But this one is way too sweet and way too sour, and they just don't mix together. So if there's one I don't suggest getting, it's going to be the cotton candy. But uh, other than that... I might end up getting a few more bags to try. Um, just, that's something I gotta think about. But anyways, thank you YouTube. There's my review on Sour Strips. Have a great and wonderful day.